The governor said that the Illinois, University of Illinois may have a ventilator design that can be mass produced. The U of I College of Engineering considers it a potential breakthrough. WCI 3's Cole Henke has more on that. They are calling it their Apollo 13 moment. A team at the U of I says they've made a breakthrough, creating a new emergency ventilator prototype that could soon be in hospitals across the state. This is a device that could be rapidly deployed. It's a simple device and suitable for emergency situations where hospital ICU ventilator is not available. A team of University of Illinois professors and Carl Health Group's medical professionals and physicians were able to do what they thought was impossible. They built an emergency ventilator prototype in just a week. The prototype, it works really well. So far, it has run for more than 75 hours, more than 125,000 breathing cycles. It's staggering what this group of brilliant people has been able to do. The team has only been working on the product for a couple of weeks. But if all goes as planned, the new ventilator could be mass produced sooner rather than later. All it needs is FDA approval. Uh, the IMA is now working with the University of Illinois and some of our medical device manufacturers to see if this can be produced in Illinois and used in hospital and health care facilities across Illinois and the United States. The university has partnered with the Illinois Manufacturers Association. Factories across Illinois are already committed to building the supplies to keep hospitals running. And if that happens, it could change the game for hospitals moving forward against COVID-19. At that moment where we all saw that it worked, it was such a moment of joy and excitement, a shared experience for our team. It was, it was really amazing. Reporting in Springfield, I'm Cole Hankey. The group now will take the prototype to clinical trials, and if it makes it through those clinical trials, then it can get FDA approval and be ready for production.